with this whole problem child persona, this whole fuck Jake Paul thing. Is this a marketing gimmick? Is this how you get fans? Yeah, no, for sure. Like good news travels fast. Bad news travels faster. People like drama. They like controversy. They like the things that are different. People want to see something that they've never seen before to cut right to the top in news in gossip and drama it's like ruffle feathers that was the strategy from day one to be a social media star how did i first break into the mainstream media i had all of these ideas and it was ruffling feathers and i can i can play that character and be the bad guy and be the villain and that's kind of how people have painted me and then i embraced it and it was like okay cool this is this is where we're gonna go with this um but it works way better in the long run than than just being the you know person with no opinion one way or the other and we see that a lot of times now is like not choosing a side is is choosing a side so Definitely very strategic and thoughtful around all of this. And it just perfectly aligns with boxing and, you know, having opponents and, and shit talking and all in the world I'm in. So fuck Jake Paul and what he says. If it weren't for Team 10, then he'd have no friends.